Up next, it is our main event of the evening between El Toro and the Ghost. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight collision. El Toro is five years his elder. The Ghost is four inches taller. He will have a five inch reach advantage. Once again, here's the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the El Toro. Here you go, first one, you ready? You ready? Let's Here go, we on. go! Five five-minute rounds. Black trunks for the ghost. White trunks for El Toro. Beautiful jab. Oh, he lands the roundhouse to the body. And again, he goes to the roundhouse. Oh, man. That's a solid hook. hook. Oh, he caught him early. Big kick, but miss. Good check. Nice shot. Joe, there's another shot to that cut that occurred earlier in the fight, and now it's really wide open. Yeah, he keeps tagging him right on that same spot. Excellent job of timing these combinations. Wow, nice front kick. He is really finding his range with that uppercut. Absolutely, Joe. That uppercut has been lethal. Beautiful head kick. Wow. Oh, he landed an uppercut. He caught him with the head kick. Oh! This could be it right here. Oh, he's landing. Oh, that one hurt him. Oh, that knee finds a hole. Oh, ferocious knees. Guillotine, guillotine. One arm guillotine here. Wraps the leg around the back. Oh, that's tight, Mike. That is tight. Tremendous pressure on the neck. He's it is it. all over! It is all over! Set up the choke, completed the job, and got the victory. Once again, here's our fight replay. Let's see it again here. Got the choke, it's in deep, and no choice but to tap. And here we see it from another angle. Beautiful technique here, and the tap. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. Here is Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop for this contest at two minutes, 21 seconds of the very first round. Referring the winner by tap out, El Toro. El Toro, your winner by submission.